You guys having fun? Good, keep that going. Your next comedian uh, was a finalist at the Rooster Teeth Feathers comedy competition earlier this year. Please put your hands together for Miss Gail Jones. so long I can hardly stand up. <laughs> yeah, I went to the doctor and he told me I need to lose 22 pounds. I said to him, well doc, why don't you grow a third leg? So I got me one of these pedometers, you know, and you're supposed to do 10,000 steps a day and so far I've done 77. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Well, you know, it's kind of like what Rebecca was saying. The golden years suck. Could you please say that with me? The golden years suck. There's no men today. They're all dead or married. Are you, are you doing this act? Or are you agreeing with me? Well, can you agree with me later, lady, and shut up, I'm old. Do I look to you like my memory is good? Now, you may have thrown off my whole act. Aren't you ashamed of that? Yes, okay, can you please say to the audience, I am ashamed of that. I'm ashamed of that. Damn well you should be, too. Gotta put up with Blue Cross, Blue Shield, that nothing dumbass old ladies in the world. I don't know why I want to do this job. But anyhow, if you don't have anything else to say, I'll continue. Well, you may, you may have noticed, though, that uh, that I'm a southerner. I'm from Alabama, Georgia, and Tennessee. And that makes me a southern belle. Ding dong. <laughs> you know, in my house, when I was growing up, clean underwear was more important than life itself. Like my mother would say to me every time I went out, Gail, did you put on clean underwear? In case you have an accident? <laughs> She never gave a minute's thought of what would happen to my underwear if a semi hit me at 70 miles an hour. <laughs> and then you know you've heard about Southern hospitality, haven't you? Shut up! <laughs> well, you know, they'll say, Gail, yeah, come on in. Have a seat. Take a load off. We'll get you a glass of iced tea. You're laughing like you know this. <laughs> Anyhow, iced tea, you know, for Southerners is like water. And then they go off in the kitchen and they talk shit about you. <laughs> and then if you're a Southern lady, you got to be sugar and spice and everything nice. Well, <laughs> that's why I couldn't be a comic. You know what I say to that? Fuck them. <laughs> Fuck them all. As a matter of fact. And you know you would never have a southern woman tell you how old she was when my grandmother died. She had inscribed on her tombstone, How old do I look? <laughs> my name is Gail Jones. Good night.
Here goes everybody. One more time. Let it go.